So what's up guys, Benji from VFX Bros, and today we just have a quick tip for you guys. We want to um, show you how we made the Spider-Man web effect, which is not so popular, but you can check it out right here in the description, or you can click the link, uh, yeah, you can click the link in the description. So let's go ahead and start. I'm going to really show you quickly how to do this, because it's not a so difficult, so difficult effect. First, I grab my footage, and me. I'm gonna solo this of me in After Effects and drag it to After Effects of me faking a Spider Man hand thingy right there. I'm just like faking it, you know, faking it, and the thing, and someone is throwing the towel at me, and we like kind of match the movement of my hand with the towel so it can be like, like matched. Or something at the same time so let's go ahead and do this again with the second one I went ahead and did, this, did the same thing the towel came a little bit later because I mean people don't have the timing but <laughs> I just like try to pull it out pretty good so um, this is the final mask final throw whatever and here comes the baseball bat baseball um, hand thingy, and so yeah, as you can see there, there it goes, and it's coming right there. It's a full quality, so I'm gonna put it in half quality so you guys see it better. All right, so this is how it looks. All right, and there it is. As you can see. You got it right there, right there, right there, and it's passed to the ground. So you, there, you can tell it's a it's a, not a fake object; it's a real object. So I'm just telling you, you right now. So let's go ahead and show you how we made this. First of all, we unsolo this, pull this back right on, and show you each layer what I did. I put a beam, which is a beam effect that basically gives you a line, and you can actually go ahead and control it. So what you do is it gives you this line. You can see right here, I know you can see it. I'm gonna show you here. This line. And it actually goes ahead and just makes everything like you can control the end point and the start point. So I I keyframe that and moved it with my hand, whatever I did, and keyframe the other end point or starting point, what I don't know which one is it, and keyframed it to the towel's position. So when I grabbed it it would be with the towel. As you can see it's right there, the red point, right there. So yeah, that's basically it. Then I added a lot of a little bit more, a beam outside, a beam outside two, beam outside three. And these are basically like beams but with turbulent displays that makes them like get the cool Spider Man effect. Spider Man web effect. As you can see with the strings right here. There it's not just a solo string but it's very a lot of strings like wrapped around it so that's about it and I like combine them together to get that shot so then I put a mask on I put a mask on and I and when when I passed b behind me actually masked it with this you know the mask and masked my body out so I, I made a duplicate of my footage Put it on top of the, all the beams of the first one and made it the mask. So that's how you get it to look like it's around, like behind you. So that's about it. Now for the, all of the shots, this one I did it without the, I mean, you can, I'm going to turn off, or turn on everything so you can see it. This one I did, it, I, I didn't have to mask every, anything on my body. And the final one, I actually had to mask a little bit. As you can see here, there's a mask. I'm going to show it to you the mask. There's the mask, and I moved it around a little bit with the footage, and you can't tell it's actually a fake. It's just awesome. I, I love this effect. I mean, I'm going to be doing more cool effects, like with this one. Oh, I'm sorry about that. I'm going to be doing cooler effects, like with this one, and I'm going to try to go ahead and just give you a little bit more detail what's going on. We're practicing the Spider-Man web effects a little bit more and bringing them to me. So that's awesome. Thank you guys.
rock on. Bye.